Okay. Hello everyone. This is Suwachi Katalus. Um, this is actually my first time uh doing a blinds react. Uh I've always wanted to do one. Um never had the courage to do it till now. I love um I just wanted to try it because I think it's fun. Um especially with like K-pop stuff. I love uh especially shiny. I love anything related to shiny. I'm a big shallow so um yeah so today i decided to do a k-pop react to key's killer uh music video it dropped earlier today about like i think eight hours ago or something like that um so we're gonna do a blinds react to it uh i love anything shiny related like every song i've loved so far for different reasons and stuff and key especially his style is like somewhere up my alley like definitely up my alley so I can't wait to see what it includes and what it has. So let's just get to it. Let's just see how this is. He always does, but like, yo, him and his like fashion, I swear to god, <laughs> so good. Type of sound. I it's one of the type of sounds that I really like. Um, it has like wait. I can't even react to it properly because I'm just like smiling like crazy. I'm like. He's grown so much as a solo artist. I'm not gonna lie. He's grown so much. Like, besides the fact that he grew as a performer at, when he was with Shiny, you know, but as a solo artist from where he started, like, you know, with, uh, with Forever You and such, um, uh, I love this fashion. That outfit was the one I love the most. <laughs> that one right there. I'm a good And I love. I actually like his hairstyle.
Okay. Alright. That is almighty key, guys. That is almighty key. Always bringing it, man. With the vocals, with the performance, with the fashion. Bruh. More? Yo, okay. Alright. Listen. Let's pause this for now. Okay. Okay. Alright, so. I'm gonna have to watch this video again, because there is, like, I, there, I, it's just the musicality, the musicality of it and everything. I loved it a lot. Uh, the fashion I liked. Um, let me see. If I had to think about it, if I really, okay. So I liked his vocals. I will say, I like the song. It may not be one of my favorite songs from them, but I do like it a lot. It's like, I like it a lot, but... I've heard uh, other songs that I like from Key a lot more than this one, but this one's still just as good. I like the rhythm of it. I The style of it is very, like... He's been going on with that, like, retro sound for a while. So, um, I do like the, like, the synth and, like, the bass of it and everything. I'm a fan of those type of sounds. Uh... But this song was pretty good. I liked it a lot. Um, I'm happy that I pre-ordered. <laughs> I pre-ordered like all the versions of the album. So I can't wait to have that in my collection. Because I'm very excited to just... When it comes to Shiny... Let me tell you something. When it comes to Shiny, I just go off and like... Everything... Shiny is like my favorite group of all time. Uh, it's just everything about them. Vocally, performance, like... Is so nice and they're so professional when it comes to these things and such um so they're my number one group for sure uh and key key's a little like bias wrecker over here okay he's like my bias wrecker all of them are but key and his performance and like all his performance he's done so far that i've seen it's just like mm. he's a uh, he's definitely definitely fighting tayman's my main bias but key he he puts a, a fight like really good fight against Taman. um i'm so happy for key because honestly i'm seeing the videos like okay so from when he started out from the start to now like you can tell how much he's improved as like a solo artist like each time he just keeps getting better and better as a solo performance because i remember at the start when he first started out as a solo um artist I don't know, it looks like he was very nervous about things, right? Like, you can get that sense, um, even on stage and stuff like that. It, it, I don't know why. It felt like he was, you know. But then again, it was his, like, you know, first time going out alone. Like, not, like, a, alone as in the sense of he's actually promoting himself. Not like, oh, he's doing a solo for a concert just for, you know, for the set list and everything, right? No, this is him actually going out and being alone and stuff like that you know without his boys behind him and stuff like without shiny being there for him right so seeing this and seeing like how he is right now and i'm like and i can tell i'm like i look at it and i'm just like bruh he's improved so much as an artist like a solo artist and stuff like he has a lot more confidence i feel like than he started out and i feel like he finally found like he's like actually already found his style and such um and I'm so proud of him. It's just like, this style really suits him. I kind of do want him to explore a little bit more, though. Um, I, He's been with this similar sound. <laughs> Not similar, but like the similar style, right? He's been at it already for like, I think, two or three songs before. Two or three. Um, let me look at my... I'm looking at my albums right now. I'm seeing... Um, I think about two songs before this one. So this would be the third one that has a similar style. Like it's not ex the same, but yeah, I I hope in um, I hope with the next one he releases, uh, it's more of a different style i want him to like really explore and i like how uh taman tries exploring and stuff like that his sound and such 
um, I really want him to also explore out because I know he can do so much, right? And this was such a good uh, song. I really do like the song. Not my favorite, but I still really love the song. I, I'm a sucker for the sound and stuff. That that retro sound, like the with the bass and the synth and everything, like dun, 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 dun. and his dance. We know, we know where he. Uh, <laughs> we we know we know where he comes. Uh, like his inspiration for dance, right? You you can clearly see his stylistic choice and how he, certain moves he does and such. It's. I'm like, oh, okay. I see you, Key. I see you. And so, um, let me see if I can go back and say anything about the dance. If, like, it's just, I'm gonna have to see this video again. Because this video, like, I, I was so excited to watch it that, like, I saw everything. But I don't think I fully processed what I saw. Because I was just like, oh, I love Key so much. <laughs> because I finally, like get to see him again and such right so i'm like very excited but his fashion i will say his fashion stood out again but we know he's a fashionista right like we've been known that if you're a shower you know very well he loves his fashion um this was really good i really did enjoy this video let me see okay over here there, there seems to be a dance break so let me oh yeah i remember this scene okay and go a little, a little bit Let's start. Promise you won't forget. I'm the killer. I love those small details that he does. Like the small movements, but it does. It makes you look at it, right? It makes you focus on like the small movements that he does. Like it looks big. Okay, real quick. It looks big, but like these little finger, t like the crawling of the fingers and stuff and like even in this part that's coming up with the arm yeah like everything like he he wants you to notice everything and i love small details when it comes to dance because all right when it comes to dance when it comes to big movements like i said those are great big movements are great because you know people from afar like in the back of the audience they can notice the big movements and the stage and everything However, I feel like the best part of like dance is when you have those small, intricate, like detail movement movements, whether it's your fingertips, like those small things is what really like makes a different, I feel like, of, you know, like what becomes like, I, I don't want to say a good dancer, but like it definitely more experienced dancers because they'll, the experienced dancers will definitely notice more of the smaller details and they'll add that into their choreography and you know i don't know i it's just like small details i i love because they're hard to get it to make it look very clean small details to make them look very clean and noticeable i feel like that's kind of hard to do right that's why in a group when i see group dances and such i always like seeing like when a group is super clean especially with their small movements like small details like whether it's like, oh, this knee goes inside out, inside out. Um, I, you guys probably don't understand what I'm saying by that. But like, like little, like bends of the knees and stuff like that, that like you wouldn't typically notice at first glance. And then you're like, oh, wait, right? So, and then if they're all clean and such with that small detail, it looks so much better. Like the, the performance and everything just elevates higher, like because how clean it is and how like detail oriented the group is and stuff and key shiny but key especially along with Taman, they're very uh detail oriented so they're very when it comes to dance it's like they focus on the small details and those small details even though it's just small like it adds a bigger picture to things and such it adds more to the performance and i'm Look at I love that. Like that move. It's simple, but the way he does it, the way he performs to it, adds to the atmosphere of the music. This one I will say. Yeah, I definitely like there's a lot more detail. 
dancers on this one that the dance for this one is a lot more it's there's a lot more details in the sense of like it's not just like oh big movements and like you know explosive movements and just make it pop it's just like he the choreography for this literally adds to the atmosphere of the music and stuff so it suits it very well um though it's not like you know a lot of movements all at once and it's not like rushing all at once uh you can tell that he adds um you know a little characteristic that makes the song the song right in the choreography i just But they still catch your attention. Oh my gosh. <laughs> and his outfit, his clothes, his fashion like this video is very aesthetically pleasing to me in the sense of like his outfit choices and the way he dressed and like i love that last uh that last um outfit with the um with the extensions and stuff like that it's just like love it so much but this was a good song i really did like it um i did like the dance uh but i think the most thing i really really did enjoy is the sound of the music and the fashion of it i really liked um a lot about it now if it comes to let's say hmm, if i had to say anything yeah i just hope the only thing i have to say and it's nothing bad about the music video or the song at all is that i hope that he is able to um uh cr fine explore explore new sounds for his next track for his next album which i am already excitedly waiting for the next song that he releases i hope it um i hope he does find a different sound just to experiment with it you know shiny's known to experiment a lot with music so i wouldn't mind if he does a little bit more experimenting and such i can't wait for his next song so that was me that's reacting for uh key's killer music video um i hope to see you guys again on the next one so have a good day guys bye